Hi there, hope your Thursday is going along nicely. Well, chilly overnight, but not quite as bad as we thought. We did have our first widespread freeze warning of the fall season issued and uh, in effect until 10 a.m. But we did see some clouds streaming off of Lake Michigan, along with some snow showers, trying to work their way in here. Not much luck with that, but that capped temperatures a little bit. Still, we did see some readings get down into the upper 20s, a chilly start. And it's going to be another chilly day on tap. This cool air streaming in out of the northwest firmly in place. We've really got a big long wave trough across the eastern well, half of the nation and uh, the chilly air is going to stick around a little moderation as we get into the weekend. Now next week we'll see a bit of a pattern change and we're going to warm things up. But unfortunately it looks like it's going to be very wet. Some drenching rains headed our way next week. So yeah, this cool air locked in place. A chilly day today. Yesterday we saw a peak wind gust of 23 and a high of 47. The wind's not quite as strong today, but even cooler highs this afternoon going for 45 in the glass city. So yeah, some clouds to the northwest along with maybe a flurry or two, but uh, we'll see plenty of sunshine across uh, portions of northwest Ohio, uh, more so as you work your way south and east. And uh, we'll see things cloud up though as we get into this afternoon, along with a chance for a hit or miss shower. We'll be just uh, passing in nature, very light nuisance type stuff. Highs this afternoon though, a full 15 degrees below normal, 45 in the glass city. We won't muster more than uh, upper 40s to the south. So a chilly day on tap with a bit of a breeze out of the west, 10 to 15. We will clear things out overnight on uh, your Thursday night. It's going to be another chilly start Friday morning. We'll start out near 30 degrees, upper 20s, lower 30s. With sunshine, we'll get into the mid and upper 40s on your Friday afternoon. Now, warm-up really kicks in on Saturday, still below normal temperature-wise, but we'll see a strong southerly breeze in advance of a weak cold front moving through. That'll get in here during the early afternoon hours, but that's going to warm us up by midday into the low and mid-50s, and this front doesn't have a whole lot of moisture, so we'll start out with sun, cloud up during the uh, late morning hours, see a few nuisance showers hit and miss during uh, the early to mid-afternoon, and then that moves to the south, and uh, we'll see the winds shift to back out of the north and that will cool us down for the day on Sunday. So really tough to pick the best day to be outside over the weekend. You're going to have to make that decision. 45 the high this afternoon, sun early, clouding up this afternoon, nuisance showers out there. Uh, really not much to speak about, but just a real chill in the air. Yeah, feels like temps close to 20 degrees below normal. We're cold overnight. The sky's clear down to 30 to start out your Friday morning. We'll see sunshine up to 47. Winds develop. After a sunny start on Saturday, it gets really windy, gusting 25, 30 miles per hour by midday on Saturday. Uh, moisture starved cold front works its way in here with a smattering of showers, not really a washout at all on Saturday and uh, into the 50s for a change. It's been a while uh, behind that front will cool things down and Sunday's high just 50 in spite of sunshine. Still 10 degrees below normal. Now we'll warm things up next week. We'll kick it in on Monday into the upper 50s by Tuesday, Wednesday. Soaking rains, widespread moving through a huge storm system headed our way. And a strong southerly flow will really warm us up nicely into the low 60s by Thursday. Once that system moves to the east, taking the rain with it, we'll cool back down with highs in the 40s again by the end of uh, the next work week heading into next weekend. So a slight warm up as we head towards the weekend. Still well below normal, but I think sun, or Saturday is as good as we're going to get. Yeah, it's going to be windy, but at least we'll feel a little bit uh, warmer temps than we've been experiencing for the past five days. Sunday, if you like sunshine, that's the pick of the weekend. So take your pick there. What you need to do today is bundle up. If it's going to be another chilly one, the cold spell continues. Thanks a lot for joining us. For your web forecast, have a great day. I'm meteorologist John James.